Lewin's here and today I'm gonna transform this into the leg mode. Also gonna compare it to some stuff in the leg mode and a little bit more than my normal just transformation. Transformers reviews, tech and the news, whatever else I use as a muse. Hit subscribe, I appreciate the views, influences, interest on YouTube. Like this, I just had it on there just because of course, gotta take that off. Get to these legs, like this. You might as well, you can untab all this stuff too, cause it tabs in here. Move it out a little bit. And what you're trying to do is take the gun off if you haven't done so. You're trying to move this wheel in. So you have to get all this stuff out of here like this. that down this right here you want to move down move the bumper back and then you match this around here and got to move this bumper like that and then push this up and it just sits there like that really flush Then you're just spinning this wheel in. So you're just trying to get all this stuff out of here so you can spin this wheel in and move it back a little bit so it fits in here. A little bit or a lot, I'm not sure. Just fit it in, it fits in well. So you got that, just close this back up. Same thing over here. Move that, move this down, down here. Flip this up here like that, put it flush, then get this where you need it to be. Flip it around, move this down. There you go, put them, put this back together like that. Now for this, move this down a little bit. There's a panel under here that you wanna get out. Just flip this out of here like that, just to keep it. Now you can fool with these arms. Just try to get all of this out. All of this is the arm. So you're getting it out and flipping around. Watch this panel right here. There we go. Make sure it you get it off of here. Mine wasn't on too well, so. And that, that was by design. So I didn't have this whole thing to contend with. Now we're trying to get these tires back in here. We unpeg them. They're pegged up here. So you unpeg them and then you pull them back a little bit. Then you can move them down and flip this up and do it as best as possible to get it around all of this stuff. As you're going, you're flipping this back down and then this will go all the way up in there as in robot mode. So again, move that out, flip this out at that little space right there and flip these around. There you go. Now you wanna collapse this is on a collapsible thing right here. So you wanna move this down first, move that out because then you're gonna get this piece. There's a extension right here that comes out I did have a mistake before and didn't know what it was. So it sticks out there. And now you push this uh, here. I think it goes there like that. And this pushes all the way down and 
clips in right there. I think it should clip in. Does it clip in? And this really is supposed to stay. Let me put this together because this is supposed to come up here like that. There we go. But at the same time, you're supposed to push this down here. And I think it stays in this little section area right there like that. That around here, there's enough space in between these to uh, collapse around this. So you can still get this all like that. And everything should be straight, connected. That's how this looks. This isn't, this doesn't connect as well as it should, but it, it's all right. We'll see what happens when you're moving around. Now you're down here with all this mess. First, what you want to do is get these arms back together. So you're moving this like this and in there. Kind of collapse this first as best as possible. Then you can kind of collapse that like that. And again, like this and like that. And one thing you do want to do now, which these weren't really, uh, didn't really matter because it's, it's so tight, but with the weight of the cabana, it might matter. So there's the lock that you got to push up so you can't move these legs these or these arms can't move out that's what this lock is for and that's why you moved it from robot to vehicle so you could move the arms out but it didn't really matter because it didn't it didn't do that much to it so after we get these uh arms done now this is where this comes in there's a lot of places where you have to uh get it right so move this up here like this um both sides both sides move up like this and if you don't have this out already you gotta move these out because it's gonna uh connect onto the shovel so with that said also just to get it these right here let me make sure i have these right because i think the pegs got to be in side or the locks got to be inside so there we go like that um now this right here these are going to lock into here but in order to do so you need to move this down so because there's two tabs on each side and you got to move it down in order to get it to lock so you can just move it a little bit. It doesn't have to be all the way like that. Just just enough to fit around here. And now let's go with the back. Now this fits in here through this thing. And this connects here with the little, there's a tab that goes into here and these of course clamp around these things right here you can see that tab and tabs right here you can see that all right get this back together and you may have to move all of this stuff definitely have to move all of this stuff like that in order to get it out the way there we go and then this goes show it like this Super secure, tight. These two things go into here. So you move them up and you get them. You got you got the double hinges here. Don't forget in order to make use of those or, or don't forget to make use of those. <laughs> so you can spread that apart and get this in here. And it kind of 
you kind of know where it's supposed to go from that. So let's get this first. Move this around here. It's not, it's not super hard, but I mean, it does take some doing. This, you wanna move up here like this and clamp right here to create that look. And now you want to, you can stand it up and kind of get these arms angled at the right because they might not be angled at the right point. And then you can try to get this together. Uh, it's funny because I don't even have it together and it's, it's stable. <laughs> stable right now is without it being all the way. Make sure you move these in. I think they gotta go in in order to reach. Yeah, it looks like it. Then you get this up. Hopefully all this doesn't fall apart, <laughs> but it might. This is probably the most frustrating part right here, trying to get this stuff together. You may need to turn the arms if the arms aren't completely straight you may not have it in the right spot there we go that's probably what it was for that side and this side yeah it wasn't it wasn't too difficult but and there we are uh you got the the legs joint right here that you can use. You also got this other joint, I think. Um, let me see. Yeah, it's a joint here that you can use as well. You can see that. Uh, yeah, that's a joint, right? Yeah. I think this has to be somewhere else. I'm not sure, but I might not have that right. Cause it definitely is supposed to be this rocker. Cause this is the rocker, the ankle rocker. And so there, this is all about stability. Cause there is no ankle rocker down here. All this is just for looks. Like this is just just for being stable, but the ankle rocker is right here. So this is like the whole foot. So you can see, you can see what I mean. So here's Superion. I didn't want to take him out of his pose, but just so you can see kind of where he is and the leg goes up to almost the waist or it does go to the waist so that's this is like the whole this is probably going to be the whole leg but there is probably going to be waist uh, i'm thinking i don't know to tell you the truth i don't know if they're going to have pants or if they're not going to have any middle parts forming because technically long haul could be the whole long haul is going to be a uh, beast <laughs> I know it is because it's going to have to transform if they don't have any extra parts, which I can't see them not having it. They don't long haul <clears throat> is going to have to transform. Let me show into all of this. I, I would assume long haul would be this, which is his, his pelvis and his lower abdomen. And then maybe a hook will be at the top like normal but but i don't know i don't know what do i know 
but we'll see all right so thanks for watching i'll get over to another one you know life ain't no life ain't no life ain't no as long as you alive you can give another try and take it real high if you want